It's totally Caddis Maximus here. This time I'm bringing you a review of this stubby and standard length handle Malco locking quarter, quarter inch drive, you know, bit driver handles. Anyway, these seemed pretty decent. They were actually a little bit spendy, to tell you the truth. I think I paid 20 bucks for both of these. But it's kind of hard to find regular old nice acetate handle or acetate drive, bit driver handles that are actually the locking style, and I was surprised that Malco has these. Malco is really known for their uh, heating, venting, uh, HVAC, heating, venting, and air, air conditioning tools, sheet metal tools, that type of stuff. So this is kind of right up their alley, and I think they're actually pretty decent. The biggest, uh, well, there's one oddity, which they call these the Connects 1 and the Connects 2, kind of odd naming. It's just a simple silk screening. They didn't even, like, put an embossing in the mold so that this wouldn't wear off. So they're obviously getting these, you know, sourcing them from somewhere and then just having their name silk screen on it. So it's a little cheesy because that's going to wear off in no time. Otherwise they do have nice, this it's kind of a light gray driver handle and pretty smooth working, pretty heavy duty with decent knurling locking ends. And that's really what I liked about these. Actually, if we take a look at where these, these are made, they're made in Taiwan, and I think they have, there we go, lifetime warranty. Work, perform, outlast. So anyway, the real deal about these, besides being locking, it's kind of hard to find locking ones, is I really appreciated these. They are pretty thick, definitely more than heavy duty. And what we can see is they're side locking. There's a ball there, but if we rotate it around, dual side locking ball. So I really like that it was pretty heavy duty. The only other actual locking driver handles... I had were this one, which was kind of funky to use because you got to screw it and unscrew it, and it is aluminum. And I had this style here. This one is uh, just a cheap, cheapo Chinese one, but it does have something that the Malcos don't, which is surprising. This cheap Chinese one, you can just push the bit in and it's locking. But of course, it's a rubberized handle, so I wanted something more durable. With the Malcos, due to the nature of those, the bearing mechanism, you do have to retract the collar, although it is really perfectly measured. There's almost no play back and forth. I'll give you a quick example. If we go back into this, there's a bit of play back and forth. Even in this uh, lock, this is not the nice Bosch. This is like a cheapo driver handle. We locked that in quite a bit of play. So I did like that a lot about these Malcos is the fact that they do have good measurement. One of the caveats to these is if you're using like one of these double-ended bits or has a bit of an extension, this is just not going to lock in. Just And it's a little bit disappointing, but it's not too bad. And since these are used in HVAC situations, I believe that's why they ended up having such short stems. See, many... Let me get some other ones out here. You know, most other... I have a decent... I have a, German made Craftsman, Easy Power here, even an SK. And so they usually have pretty long stems on these driver handles. And these are much more compact. And I think that's just due to the nature, once again, of being an HVAC where you're in a little bit more restricted situations and you can always add an extension. The other nice thing about the locking ones is that fact if you use one of these with a locking extension and then you put in a bit nothing's coming apart if it gets caught up in something maybe the bit gets a little jammed in the fastener that's the great thing is you can pull it out maybe if you drop it you're not going to have parts all flying you know different pieces <laughs> flying everywhere it's all held together and so that's really what i like about these not a whole lot else to say besides i like them i think they're actually pretty decent the only other thing is due to this big uh locking collar it's not as tight as it could be. Here I have this uh, older Apex, and we can see that it is substantially shorter, probably a half inch shorter than this Malco. Even the handle is just a little bit shorter. One thing I would say is that the Malco uses a hex, which is, or a six-sided handle, which is just fine, but I think I would have preferred something more like this Apex, where it's a four-wing with deeper grooves. That way those deeper, you know, on something like this, you just get a bit more uh, grip and purchase on something that's stubby where you don't have uh, just as much surface area to work with. Or on this Malco, it could have been a little bit better. 
and maybe had more of a lip down there to hold your fingers, kind of like the Apex. So I think they do a couple minor improvements, but once again, I feel okay about the 20 bucks I spent. Anyway, I really appreciate everybody who's been watching and subscribing. And if you haven't subscribed, please do. Until next time, Caddis Max, what's up?